um hey guys uh welcome back in today's video this will be the first subnautica episode today i'll be just showing you how to get diamonds in subnautica so what you'll need is like a sea guide or a sea moth and that's about it and a compass so you want to head around north northeast so let me head to my sea guide here and we want to head around here about this direction and we're only going to be heading to the mushroom field so don't worry about like dangers or anything you shouldn't really get killed i mean we're not going too far into the mushroom field so you shouldn't have to worry about the reaper that's in there let's just head this way and it doesn't take that long to get to but there's just going to be a quick tutorial and this is a very early game viable strategy so you don't have to be far into the game to do this clearly because all you have to do is head in a sea glide or a sea moth i would recommend a rebreather i wouldn't not i would not say it's a late game but i would not say it's that early ish game i mean it's like like very early it's a early game thing you should have around this point that you're looking for diamonds you should have the stuff needed and you just want to look around the walls here and you should find slate now let's look for some slate outcrops along the walls Okay, it would help if it would, they'd actually show up. Wait, we have to get past this creep vine wall. It's too late to go to the sea mouth already. But anyways, if you just look around the walls, I don't think anything will show up in this in the in the kelp forest wall. But walls that are like designated mushroom forest walls, you will see some slate so if we look here we so lithium there you go you can find lithium around there you could also find lithium in the slate and if you're wondering that's just a bone shark here's the lithium well hopefully it's just a bone shark but you're not going basically anywhere in the mushroom fields. What we're doing is we're just going to scan the outsides here. Scan the outsides of the mushroom field. Scour them. And, like, this is a good wall to look at. And you should find some slate here. If we could find one, that would be great. Wait, let me get a scanner room down. It will show you how much their act of slate there actually is. That was interesting. Okay, let's get a hatch. And now let's get like what should we get? Um scanner room HUD chip, of course. Um then I guess just range upgrades. So we'll get like two range. We'll get to range, sure. There we go. And now we can scan for Reaper Leviathan. Oh, found one. Alright, so you gotta be cautious. But, anyways, let's look and slate chunk. If you look at the map. found one shale chunk that's it what I swear there's more shale wait but look let's look for lithium we could probably find a ton of lithium uh, lithium it might be, be because i put this in a bad spot but you know check the edges of the thing let me get a speed upgrade maybe i need speed We'll get scanner room speed. Scanner room speed. Yep, 
Yeah, I don't think it's gonna find anything. But look, let's just head over there. So look, there's a sail trunk, there's a slate trunk. So this was kind of farther in, but this one, as you can see, is on the wall. So like right here, you break it. Look, we got gold there. There's another just over here. See, so there is a decent chunk of them. And they're not that far in. That's all. We got a lithium. There's one here. We got a diamond. There you go. Alright. Look, as you see, more and more are popping in here. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, like, subscribe, hit the bell. Hope this helped you out. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.